Hi everybody, the purpose of this video is to show you how to uh, download a picture from the internet and put it in your PB Works site. So I'm going to open a new tab, I'm going to go to Google, and I want to click up here where it says images. And let's say that I am uh, writing a journal entry, and in my journal entry I'm writing about a waterfall. I'm going to type in waterfall and search. And then I'm going to go scroll down until I find a good one. Hmm. Uh, let's see. I like this one here the best. So I'm going to click that. And I'm going to right click the picture with the mouse. I go down to save image as. Now I'm automatically taken to my download folder which is a great place to store your pictures. You may also be uh, directed to your pictures folder. It really depends on the settings for your computer. But I'm going to go ahead and put it in my downloads folder. Folder. Just pay careful attention to where it goes so you know how to find it later. And this is called Waterfall 88. I'm going to call this uh, Tara's Waterfall. So I can see it's downloading down here. Now I need to go into PB Works where I have my journal entry. So here I am. I've got to get back to where my journal entry is so I can put the image on that page. So here's the journals. Click that. The journal entry I'm working on is against the odds. Now I have to find my page. Luckily, mine's right here. Um, so I'm going to click this. I need to go into the editing view. I'm going to go to the end because I know I, I don't want the picture in the front. I want my cursor to be down a little bit right here. So I'm going to put the picture there. I'm going to go to um, images and files over here because I want to upload the file. So there's a link here that says upload file. So I click that. Now I'm automatically directed to my downloads folder. Make sure that you are in the same folder where you just downloaded the picture to. So I'm going to search, uh, scroll down and look for the waterfall picture. And I called it Tara's waterfall. So it looks like these are in alphabetical order. Here we go. So there I double click that. You can see it's uploading. Now it's going to come over here in this list. They are in order by most recent. So here's my picture. I click that. I add it to my document. Wow, it's really big. I think I want to shrink it down. So I'm going to click it and you notice how it goes blue. If I go down here, I have a, um, a white square on the end and I like to call these see how the cursor turns to be I call it handlebars I don't know what the real name is for but I just click the handlebars and I drag it diagonally in and that's going to make my picture smaller and I can click and drag the handlebars in as much as I need to to get the picture to where it's a manageable size if I click out here where it's white my picture goes back to normal so now I'm going to go ahead and save my picture and my document and you can see, there it is. And that is how you add a picture in PB Works.